Hello guys, welcome back. And it has been long since I was posting because I had school stuff. And yeah, I'm sorry. I forgot I had just, you know, I had like two other accounts, which are basically like all the channels. And yeah, so um, today I'm gonna show you guys how to add like in the repeated of the comment section. You could, you could use this anywhere else, not just comment section, not just the comment section, but the code is going to be pretty difficult if you don't like, if you want to do it for something else. I specifically made it easy for you guys to just copy and paste and then just change what you want to change. If you've been following from part one, you don't need to change anything. Just copy and paste and then just add like like button and then name it to what I tell you to name it and all you gotta do is just copy and paste and you're good to go if you name it exactly how I name it and collapse like if you do what I do all you gotta do in the code is literally copy and paste let's get it okay so guys I'm back and uh, this video is gonna be actually pretty fast and I'm, I'm not trying to make it long for you guys because I know you guys want to be in a hurry for something like this. This is where we left off. I haven't really been progressing on this website because it's not, I'm not using it. It's just a note for you guys. If you guys need something like converting or liking it repeated to dynamic page, I'm going to do that next video. Not next video, but you know, it's not going to be a series of adding to comment section because it's not part of it just you know adding like to dynamic pages okay so the first thing you want to do is go to your connection go to your data go to your collection <laughs> and then you know your collection you're gonna go you're gonna create a new likes just title it likes and then you don't want to save it yet you want to change this to array and then you want to save just name me what I do and all you gotta do is copy and paste. If, if it's not likes, you're gonna it's gonna be pretty tough for you. Then you're gonna click on likes, say like a few key likes, and then you wanna go back to the editor and then you wanna add a, like your design. Just create a heart. This one you could change because it's a design up like it doesn't affect developer mode thing. <laughs> okay, but and then I'm going to look for heart because that's what I need. And I need this one because it looks fancy. This one's just, just speak what it looks like. And then you want to, you want to add it, you want to design it. You want to make it, no, you, wanna, you don't want to make it duplicate yet. You want to design to make it duplicate because then it's easier for you. But then I want this to be like the theme color. And I'm pretty much done. No, and also this, I want to say, I want to keep original proportion so then it doesn't shrink anyway. So now, I don't add it, I want to duplicate this. Now this one, it doesn't matter what I want to just duplicate this. And I want to design, and now you want to make this, you want to apply border to the thing. And then you want to make it to, and then you want to make this, this, and then you want to make the field color empty. Because this shows like when you like it, this hides and it just adds to collection, just save to collection basically. And you want to shrink this to the, you want to start adding this to your repeater. And then now, what you're gonna do is name this exactly what I name it. You want to name this Empty Heart. Empty Heart. And then you want to name this Foo Heart. Now that's the first coding part. And then you want to shrink this the way you want it to be. This It has to be the same thing so we like blends in. Okay. Wait. Okay. And then. Now we're good to go, but I don't want this here. I want to, I want to overlap in each other. But before I do that, I want you guys, I want, I want you guys to collapse this. I want you to hide it. I want you to collapse it. 
it's gonna have a use, trust me. And then nine is collapsing here. Okay, what the fuck? What, what just happened? Way to go. Hey, undo. Undo. Dude, <laughs> is this glitching? Hide. Collapse. Bro, what's going on? I can't collapse it and hide it? Okay, there we go. Jesus. And it's not even... Okay, you want to... Okay, I'm confused. Why is this glitching, bro? Copy and paste. I want to duplicate this. Cause it just glitched, bro. And you want it, you want it to be full heart. You want to not apply the border. Then you want to rename this back. Full heart. Bro, it just skips a full heart. Bro, is the other one missing? Why did it just disappear, dude? It says it's still there, so I mean, I don't need to duplicate. I can just undo everything so I get it back. Dude, this is so weird. Okay. <laughs> and then, you know, just wax. <laughs> it usually glitches sometimes, bro. So now you're done with that part. You want to click add text. And you want it, you you could just add any text, and then you wanna edit, just design it, bro. And literally anything. Thirteen. I don't need it that big, bro, cause I need the width to be like fifty, and I want it black. Okay, I'm gonna remove this, so it doesn't mess it up. Look. And then you want it, just design, just place this anywhere you want. Go for the, oh my god, is this happening again? This happening again. I want this here, why, why, okay. Oh, I didn't add it on the repeater. 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 <laughs> okay, I don't know that, whatever. And then I'm gonna add this right there. And then you wanna name this likes. L O I C K E S S C L O I K E S. You want to name this likes once you place it right there. And then that's for the first part. Then all we got to do next up is just copy and paste the code. I'll be right back. Hello, guys. Welcome back. And I didn't be able to do anything. All I just did was copy the code from like where I like wrote it, you know, the Google Docs I gave. And there's it right here. Coding part five, I just showed this. And I just, this whole thing, just copy from here, this function all the way. Keep going just all the way. You keep going down. All the way to here. Oh, keep going on. It's a lot of code, guys. That's that's how I suffered for y'all. I mean, it's not basically mine. It was off of some guy like that. Up to here. That's what to copy. And don't copy the gray ones. The gray ones are like in the past part. That doesn't need to be here. Just didn't need the fresh ones. And yeah this is a lot of code just copy all that and then i'm gonna show you guys what to change even though there's pretty much nothing to change and it needs to be grayed out but i'm gonna do that like after recording this video and then i'm gonna head back to where i was okay and there we go i'm right here and now all we gotta do is come on here and then paste Paste the whole code right. Control B. Okay, there we go. And going over this is a pain, guys. But <laughs> I'm gonna try. <laughs> if you don't get it, just copy and paste shit, man. I don't care. Just as long as you got your, go your stuff going on, we good. So now all I just did was the repeater 
an item ready and then get the item data guys this is not possible <laughs> I, I cannot do this i'm just, just you know what <clears throat> just keep going to yeah, i just decided to stop this video is going to be long because it is but you know what i'm not going to do it no psych i lied all you got all i gotta tell you is if you want to change your collection just change this this collection with that the update just that's your collection id goes there this collection id goes here this collection id goes here and i think that's it and then the bounce you can remove the effects it shows like when you show it empty how to show you can make this empty or you could add an effect if if this is showing an error right here you could just delete the whole thing inside a box or you could fix it i'm gonna show you guys how to fix it if you want if you want the effect you know the bounce effect you know when you click like you know you click on the heart you just <laughs> it's like it doesn't make a sound it's just like the bounce you know what i'm saying and then if the user is not logged in it, it's gonna just bounce and then open back up and it's gonna lead the person to log in if you don't want this and you want like anybody to just like your stuff you could delete this if statement and the else statement and then we're good to go so I'm minimize and after copying you know, all that why don't I have an error I don't have a let send a bounce okay so I do have the let send a bounce if you're having the error all you gotta do is copy this let send a bounce and then you're gonna fix that error because if you don't have this for example I'm gonna delete this if you don't have it you're gonna have these errors like this all you gotta do is add these less and the bounds control Z all you gotta do is add the less and the bounds and uh, I believe it should work now like this and then I'm gonna preview the site let's go, let's go. I, I hope it doesn't glitch y'all I'm tired already, man. Uh, yeah, what I say is glitching, y'all. It's not doing, you can't even click on. Oh, my bad. Yeah, you see, I know, that's what I'm talking about. Are you, I didn't, the function, I didn't add it on the data set already. Or oh, I didn't just, I didn't run the function. I just created it on data set one already. You want to add the like data and then now and it should work guys this should be a vector art not an image i mean it could be an image but you know it would be better if it was a vector art Again. okay no errors no errors we still chilling it should say zero. Oh, it says one. Oh, because i already liked it already before now I had to practice and I forgot to delete it and make it look brand new but whatever and then this should be in dynamic page titled food special edition I can't believe it's still working food special edition there you go because I filtered it according to what I did so if this picture changed I just happened to change it and this is don't don't worry about this whole page right here this is just like info You don't want to listen to that song. It's called Food by DJ Bond 26. Me and you can look it up on Google and then listen to the trash song I did. Bro, this is. If you want trash songs, my nigga, I got you. Alright? Okay. <clears throat> Professional. Let's go. <clears throat> and then it works. So then if I already liked it, if you click on it, it, it says zero. It says one. And if you. Okay, that was it, guys. Thank you for watching. And if you want to hang around and you might want to subscribe to my YouTube channel, even though I got only three subscribers, I'm not here for the, you know, just being a YouTuber. I'm here to help. I help people who need, you know, help <laughs> and stuff. And I got school what's going on, so I might not be posting every time. And yeah, next part, I might do, you know, the user who like adds his comment can be able to delete it. And you know, delete comments. I don't know about updating comments, but uh, 
yeah you could update it you could delete it and you could copy it kind of. that's the only two I could do just copy and delete and report it. oh yeah report you could report a comment I could do that too if you guys want so I'm gonna work on that if I, if I figured it out a classy way to report comments I, I could, I'm gonna do it for y'all just subscribe and bye bye y'all and I'm a dick